and welcome back to the channel and no this isn't a mistake or anything you are on Oregon e-biker mark channel and we are looking at a golf course and the reason why we are starting out from a golf course is not that I'm going to be playing golf today I'm not really a golfer but the story today is going to tie golf in with electric bikes, I'm going to hop on the bike now and tell you this story here. Really interesting uh, story that I came across today. And so I thought, oh, I'm going to get on the bike and do a video today and share with you guys this story. It's pretty cool. If you're a golfer, you might be interested in this. So. In my looking around for happenings and what's going on in the e-bike world, I try to keep up to date with what's going on. Different stories out there and, and things like that. Different bikes that are coming out. I'm always trying to keep up with everything as much as I can. Of course, nobody can know everything about the electric bike world, but I like to keep keep abreast with what's going on. So. So the story that I came across was to do with electric bikes replacing golf carts. So this one company, so their actual website is called Fair, Fairway Bikes. I believe that's what it is. I'll leave a link in the description. So if you want to go and check this out, uh, you can do so. So what it is, is they're looking to replace golf carts with these electric bikes. And they're basically a reverse trike. So a reverse trike, if you're not familiar with what that is, that's a trike that has the two wheels in the front and the single wheel in the, in the back. And so with this reverse trike, you would have your golf clubs would sit in the front between the two front tires. So I don't know a whole lot about the bike other than I do know the top speed. So the bike has a speed, top speed of 12 miles per hour. And I don't know the motor size or battery size or voltage, but it looks like the motor is a mid drive motor. And the battery, it, even though it doesn't give you the amp hours, uh, it does tell you that it will get 20 plus miles of range. And it accommodates riders from uh, five feet up to six foot four, and riders up to 300 pounds. So you can be a pretty big golfer and uh, they'll handle handle your weight now I don't know maybe that is uh, 300 pounds including the golf clubs it didn't say that in what I read but it could very well be that but still 300 pounds is pretty good and let's see what else did it say about that bike it's a single speed and it had uh, five or has five pedal assist levels the drivetrain is a uh, belt. It's a belt driven, which is really cool. Uh, it does have disc brakes. It does have a dual front suspension. And I believe that's about all I know on the bike. It looks pretty good. The color I saw was like a green, a light green color. And uh, it kind of matches the grass, I guess. And it could be a way of the future right there. The uh, one thing I could not find, I tried my best to try to find a price. And I could not pr find a price on this. But uh, that could be uh, your future right there, electric bikes carrying your golf clubs around. Now, 
I live not far from that golf course that we were just at, and uh, I've seen a few golfers that go over there to use that golf course, and they use their electric bikes to pull their uh, clubs along, which is really cool. And of course, a lot of people still have the um, golf carts, and then some people choose to walk. I would uh, like the bike, actually. I think that'd be pretty cool. So we'll see where that goes. I just thought that was an interesting uh, story and I thought I would share it with you all out there. So let me know what you think of that. Do you golf first of all? And if you do, do you are you one to use the golf cart? Or are you more of a, a walker and carry your clubs? And would you uh, be interested in this bike if that was an option for you? So that's going to do it for this video, quick video here as we're in between raindrops today. So I'm able to get a, a little ride in here. It's kind of cool too, it's about 60 degrees right now and it feels cool, kind of a damp day. So hey, if you like this video, go ahead and hit the like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, thank you very much for doing that, just hit the subscribe button. Also, if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit the notification bell and you'll get a, a notification that a new video is up. Pretty much every day I put a video up. I haven't missed a day in quite a while. And if you would like to comment, maybe you have a thought on that, uh, uh, using a bike to uh, carry your golf clubs around instead of a golf cart. What do you think of that? And if you want to comment, of course, on any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me on this video. And until next time, keep your wheels on the road. See you later.